I want to introduce new technique for volume on the finger. I am Ji Hyun Kim. Let me think old and current method. Among tens of popular methods, so-called extension block method is most commonly used. One K bar is for the block, the migration of a bird's pregnant, and second K bar is for the temporary fixation of joint. Uh, some kind of variations are easily found in journals and Googles. But most of them are very similar and share common things. First, extension uh, minimum 2K wire is one joint, relatively very small finger joint. Second, immobilization is essential. Many doctors recommended minimum 6 weeks. Third, after immobilization, we need a rehabilitation. It takes sometimes painful and takes several weeks. So we want no K wire in joint. And only RM exercise as soon as possible. Of course, the better the shoulder rehabilitation. So we need a new method. Indication of delta wire technique is the bony mallet finger. The larger the better fragment is type 1 or type 2. Steps. With 18 gauge needle, I push the fragment directly under C arm. Counterforce should be placed on the base of this phalanx. Do not try to push the distal phalanx, distal part of the phalanx. It could be a case, a cause of joint subluxation, especially type 2. Insert a small K wire through an 18 gauge needle. Small K wire means 0.8 millimeter. and penetrate the fragment and phalanx together and remove the needle cut the K wire and make a small hook like this pull the K wire gently on the skin make a tap wound using 18 gauge needle and insert K wire under the skin and make uh, another hook uh, that is uh, bigger than before. Insert another K wire, one millimeter diameter, along the axis of phalanx. Do not penetrate the joint. And bend, uh, bend and make a, a hook like the picture. The distance between two block uh, hooks is about 2 or 3 millimeters. Join two hooks. It may serve compressive force on the pressure site, at least reduction loss. Let me show the case. Uh, this is a usual pattern of bony male finger. We apply delta wire. While delta wire, the joint is allowed, allowed to move actively and passively. After removing K wire, we do not need ROM exercise and levitation. Delta wire technique has no K wires in the joint. Delta Y technique do not need immobilization nor libertation. This is a reference. You do not need read. Uh, you do not need to read the paper because this video show the detail already. Thanks for watching.